What's up, everybody? Infinite PC Gaming here to give you a quick uh, and easy tweak for your AMD Crossfire setup uh, to run the game Middle Earth Shadow of Mortar with uh, higher frames per second. So what we're going to do is we're just going to right-click on our desktop. We're going to go to AMD Catalyst Control Center. It's CCC for short. Okay. This is we're going to go right over here to the gaming section. We're going to click on AMD Crossfire. Uh, make sure you have it enabled if you don't. Okay, so if you don't have it enabled, check it, click apply. All right, and then go to 3D application settings. And since you're going to be starting this new, just click add. Uh, click the, the shortcut to, you know, wherever your EXE is. Whoops, and then uh, you click open. Okay, so then you're going to come over here and uh, you can do uh, one of two things. I mean, you can just copy this uh, the settings I have down right here, or you can just change the only option that you really do need to change. And that is down here in the AMD Crossfire section. Turn frame pacing on, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna choose uh, we're gonna choose AFR friendly from uh, the Crossfire mode. AFR friendly is use alternate frame rendering for applications that do not have pre predefined um, uh, Crossfire profiles, which with the Shadow of Mordor it does not have any uh, Crossfire um, profiles. So uh, I mean, hopefully it's something that you know we're gonna get later on in future, uh, in you know in the future. But um, doing this quick uh, this quick tweak, it gained me 50 frames per second, and that is absolutely crazy. Really, uh, it, it really surprised me when I did this. Unfortunately, though, the one the only downside to doing this though is when you're in the menu of the game, is gonna be a whole lot of flickering during the menus, but. Um, in game wise there's not going to be any uh flickering i mean I, I have noticed it just a tiny tiny bit like in the far distance and you know in the background so it's really nothing that uh was really distracting in the game um you you know you're probably not even going to notice it until you look for it to to be honest with you so um besides the flickering of uh, the menu options everything else works perfectly fine the game runs nice and smooth and uh, I mean that's what we want, right? So I hope this uh, this simple tweak helped you guys out. Uh, please like the video; that'll help me out. You know, we go back and forth to help you. You help me. So thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one. Peace out.